A well man fears he's been infected with hepatitis B after tackling a thief outside his home. The 15-minute struggle began when two bandits were caught stealing from his work truck early this morning. A large bite mark on Max Bell's arm, testament to the ferocity of the fight he had with one of two thieves who he disturbed stealing copper wire from his work truck. I uh, just looked straight out the window because the truck's been targeted before and noticed there was somebody on the truck. His first reaction was to fly out there. He ran, he ran out there. Mr Bell catching up with one of the thieves in the street outside his well and home just after 1am. As I grabbed him and turned him around, I realised that he had a bar and I sort of stopped that arm from hitting it, just sort of contacted me in the back of the head and then I realised I had to get him down. My husband threw him on the ground and sat on him. While the second bandit fled, Mr Bell continued to wrestle with the man he'd caught. Constantly trying to get out and I was concerned about the other person maybe coming back. And it was during the struggle he was bitten. That's a little bit concerning. The frightening thing for me is that he's drawn blood biting him. Police who arrived to make the arrest telling Mr Bell the offender has hepatitis B. So now he faces an anxious wait for test results to find out if he's been infected. This is not the first time the Bell family has been targeted. In fact, thieves have broken into the toolbox three times in eight weeks. And over a 10-year period, over $15,000 worth of copper has been stolen. It's amazing what you can do when you're <laughs> full of adrenaline and I've been wanting to catch them for a while. Tracy Alexander, Nine News.